Okay, here is the cabin we are staying in. Once I get over here, I'll show you. It's got a outhouse, but I mean, this is a neat cabin. Has no electric. Does have gas to it. And I'll show you all that inside here in a few minutes. And this one actually has three bedrooms downstairs and one upstairs, but it's hot as heck, so the window has to be opened in it. I just like the way they did the stone on this one. Walk up on the porch and uh, show you that. I like door latches too. Got big old pieces of stone on the floor here. And a bench somebody built there. Excuse me. I don't know why they got a shutters on this. And it's cool right here on the porch. Now the bedroom upstairs, it's pretty hot up there right now. See how they've done the uh, logs going through there. <clears throat> Actually, triple those up. And then here's your view, y'all. Fall down the steps here in a minute, but walk out here. Show you the view. And this trail goes down to the Greenbrier River, which I will walk down there here in just a few. After we get the inside of it and everything. I mean, this is nice and quiet. We have no cell phone reception out here either. So, no power. And here is our little picnic area over here. I don't know if this is a community like to both share. I wouldn't assume since there's a bunch of space. At number six, we're staying in there tomorrow night. We'll get the inside on it. But they got a little fire ring there and a little, uh, oh, heck, put your charcoal in right there and two picnic tables right here. We're parked out front. All right, I better go, go on in here and check it out. All right, now we're going to the inside. Hardwood floors, big old picnic table. Very uncomfortable uh, couch, chair, wood fireplace, hard to see in here. And this is why, this is our lighting. I didn't light them all, but I lit a bunch of them. And got a little love seat there, another chair. I don't know who's going to sit in this, but uh, yeah, it looks like that actually works. But we got a total of three lights here, gas refrigerator, another rocking chair. And this room has two beds in it. And then you got, this is a neat part. There's actually a loft up there. There's a little bedroom we'll walk up to here in a minute. And we got two fold, three, four fold away beds. Oh man, you yeah, don't think I'll be sleeping on those. Bedrooms are very small in here. Each one has a gas light. Um, oh, the life jackets are in here. Okay, and we actually got free access to a boat up there and life jackets that we ain't got to pay for. So that's pretty doggone neat. And they got the... Uh, Old doors with the knobs. So it's been around for a while. This ain't, I doubt these doors were on this thing. And that one's got a gas light and a dresser, blanket. Okay, let's go upstairs. Check it out. Kind of narrow going up. And we hit the heat wave. Oops, I got the lights on. We're going to get gassed out up here. Let's hit the windows open. Oh, wow, it is open and it's hot. Uh, about 100 degrees up here. Golly. 
yeah, it's open. Put a mirror window up here, it looks like. There's your view outside anyways. Not too bad. Whew. And I just be able to see right there. Let me see if I can get on the uh, flash. Yeah, that's pretty good. Y'all can see that without the flash. Well, that's it on the inside for right now. I might get a couple other little things and uh, go from there. You can see the uh, wood right here. I'm going to assume it was cut with an uh, axe or whatever you call that stuff. Might have been an axe. Might have been a toothpick. But it is neat. But I got to get off this dog on ceiling because it is hot up here. All right. Y'all enjoy. Have a good day. And see you on the next one.